let's look at this list of numbers. We have 1.1, 1 .1, 3, 3, 56, 43, 1.1, 1 .1, and negative 2. Which of these numbers appears the most? That's right, we have a tie here. 3 and 1.1. 1 .1. They both appear two times. Definition time! The mode is the number that appears the most. So again in this example, the mode is 1.1. 1 .1. But it's also three! We have two modes in this example because they both appear two times. <laughs> and... Let's find the difference between the smallest and the biggest numbers in our set here. 1.1, 1 .1, 3, minus 2, 3, 43, 56, and 1.1. 1 .1. Okay, so what is the smallest number? It's minus 2. So let's park that. What's the biggest number? It's 56. So let's park that. We're going to find the difference between these two numbers. So we can, for now, remove ourselves from all the rest of those numbers. Oh, remove those numbers from us. Yes, yes, of course. And now we're going to look at the difference of 56 and negative 2. Oh, do be careful here. We are subtracting a negative number from 56. So this is the same thing as adding positive 2. 56 plus 2, that's simply 58. So the range here is 58. The range is the difference between the biggest and the smallest numbers in your ordered set. So back to this example, if you're just dealing with an even number of numbers here, the one that's in the middle is going to be what's in between 1.1 1 .1 and 3. So you would ignore all of these guys and just look for the average of 1.1 1 .1 and 3. And that's going to tell you the median when your list has an even number of numbers. <laughs> Four point one divided by two, that's simply gonna give us half of four or two and half of point one or point zero five. So the median in that example with just six numbers would be two point zero five five five. Definition time. The median is the number that's in the middle when you line up all of your numbers from least to greatest. The number that's in the middle, or that would be in the middle, is the median. Be sure to subscribe, watch full-length episodes below, and God bless. Let's look at the original list of numbers we had. 1.1, 1 .1, negative 2, 3, 43, 3, 56, and 1.1. 1 .1. Now, we're going to do something wild here. Let's add up all of these numbers and then divide by 7. What's so special about 7? Look, we have 7 numbers here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So let's park that number 7. We're going to park this. Add up all these numbers. What's 3 plus 3? Three? 3 plus 3. You know the answer to that. 3 plus 3. That's good old-fashioned six. So let's replace it for now. Okay, what is six minus two? Hmm, six minus two? You know how to do that. Six minus two is just good old four. <laughs> so we took care of the negative number. That's always a good thing. Now we have 56 plus 54. Excuse me. 56 plus 43. Okay, so that's four tens and five tens, that's nine tens or 90 and three and six, that's just nine. So this is just good old 99. 99, all right, 99 plus four, you know how to do that, that's not too bad. 99 plus four, 99 plus four, yeah, oh yes, very good, very good. That's just going to be 103. And last but not least, you're gonna add up 103 plus 1.1 1 .1 plus 1.1. 1 .1. Okay, so 103 plus 1 plus 1. Uh, that's just gonna be 
Yep, you got it, 105. And then you have 0.1 and 0.1 that you're adding. So don't forget, add these guys up. And you're gonna get 105.2. Now, we talked about dividing by the number of numbers. When we do that, we're gonna have to consult our friend, Mr. Bananas. Oh snap, here comes Mr. Bananas. Wow, he sure is fast with that calculator. Adios, Mr. Bananas. Well, Mr. Bananas showed you when you divide 105.2 by the number of numbers that we had in the list, so seven, you get about 15.0285714. Let's just round up to the nearest hundredth and say 15.03. Approximately 15.03. Thanks, Mr. Bananas. <laughs> Definition time. The mean or average is the sum of the numbers in a list divided by the number of numbers in the list. Numbers. Welcome to the bonus section. Let's look at this list of numbers. Step one. Get scared. No, don't get scared. Rearrange so that...